If Margarito is smart, he lands a left hook to the body because Cotto's protecting the head, and then he brings that right hand down, and he can finish him with a left hook up top. Cotto trying to counter. This is one of those grinder fights, isn't it, guys? You know, never a backward step here. Never a, a round off. No. Cotto's right eye underneath the eye. Good hurt. combination to the head for Cotto. Hadn't seen that in a while, but here comes Margarito like, so what? Cotto still had to rely on Margarito to make an opening for him to drill him. You mentioned, Dave, it's time for the great ones to dig down. If Cotto's going to keep that undefeated record, this is the moment. And, and every time he tries to dig down, and he is trying, Margarito steps it up a level. And when he puts his but on the, the second rope, that's when Margarito tees off. Incredible action here at the MGM Grand. Antonio Margarito close to making his dream come true. Cotto Cotto's is done. wobbly. Cotto is wobbly. Margarito, Can Margarito finish it? it. Yes, Cotto's going down. Cotto just his only thing keeping him up now is his heart. Called that a knockdown because he was basically saying, I'm done, I'm done. There, he may do it now. He may do it now. Cotto's in big trouble. They're going to wave it off. His uncle had seen enough. Cotto's corner waves it off. The underdog prevails. Ladies and gentlemen, the end comes at two minutes, five seconds. Round number 11, the winner by TKO victory. Now a three-time welterweight champion of the world, the Tijuana Tornado, Antonio Margarito.